What up, it's Melvin7 here and today I'm going to show you how to complete the Haaland versus Felix objectives. Now first of all, what I would suggest, if you've got any Borussia Dortmund or Atletico Madrid kits, TIFOs or badges, sell them. As you can see, the Atletico Madrid one is 5k extinct um, and you do not need them in terms of the objectives because the uh, EA have done it in a way so you can get all of those items that you need just by playing the game. So you might as well sell. It could also be an investment opportunity. So I'm going to see if I've got the Atletico Madrid T4. I've got the Dortmund one. Mine's untradeable so I'm just going to use that for my objectives. But if I've got an Atletico Madrid one, I will sell it. I don't think I do but you never know. Nah, it would have been rare, I imagine. So yeah, I don't have a, a Atletico Madrid Tifo. I certainly don't have an animated one. Background Tifo, nope. And the rest don't matter yet. And most of them aren't even available yet. Um, in terms of badges, I don't think I've got either the Dortmund or the Atletico Madrid kit. Uh, sorry, badge. No, I don't. But yeah, literally whenever this is done, if it's done in the same way, you can see the Atletico Madrid kit there just sold for 5k. Easy coins. That would have been about a thousand before today. So it's a good investment opportunity whenever they do next ones. My guess is something like PSG, Bayern Munich, Real Madrid, Barcelona, you know, the big clubs, uh, Man United, Man City, Chelsea, that sort of thing. Anyway, so if we go on to the objectives, I have picked Haaland. The objectives, I'm not entirely sure what Felix's are, but I imagine it's the exact same as the Haaland ones, except instead of Bundesliga, it's a Liga, and instead of Borussia Dortmund, it's Atletico Madrid. So, yeah, I mean, the average experience at the minute, as you can see, Felix is actually in the lead. I'm kind of surprised, um, but it seems as though we get the same reward anyway, unless they update that. But anyhow, looking at the objective for Haaland they've done it in reverse order so the way that, if they'd have put it the other way around it would have been a bit easier but the first thing you want to do is the Dortmund scores so if you score five goals with Haaland in squad battles you obviously get a lone version of whatever player you pick for your team so you'll have a lone Joao Felix or Haaland um, so anyhow score five goals uh, with Haaland in squad battles on professional I'm going to do that hopefully in one game. It shouldn't be too difficult. Maybe professional it might take you two, three games. But once you've got that, it gives you, as you can see, the objective reward. It gives you a kit which enables you to do the hat trick. Because as you can see, you need to score a hat trick with Haaland on any game mode. You can even invite your friend for this. If you can't be asked after you've played a squad battles game and you've got your five goals, you've got your kit, you've assigned the kit. I will show you all this later in the video as well, of course. But once you've assigned that, you can invite your, your mate to play a game, let him score three, let him, let you, <laughs> score three goals with Haaland and then get him to back out. And once you do that, you'll get the Borussia Dortmund badge and then that'll enable you to do this, which is play five rivals matches with at least one Dortmund player in your starting squad while using the Dortmund badge. Then once you've done your five rivals games, you can do this because that one gives you the Borussia Dortmund Tifo. So you can get the five assists with a Borussia Dortmund player in squad battles on professional difficulty while using the Tifo. And that gives you, well, just experience and the premium Electrum players pack. Now, of course, you can go out and you can buy the Tifo, the badge, the kit, but they're all being price fixed for 5k extinct. Pretty, well, it's not price fix, it's just what they're going for because everyone's trying to buy them. But as I say in this video, you do not need them. You just need a little bit of patience. You get this done, hopefully in one squad battles game. Then you can invite your friend, get it done in like two minutes, this next one. So that makes the only one that's time consuming is playing five rivals with a Dortmund player. But you don't need to win. You don't need to do anything. You just need to have the Dortmund badge enabled. So that's the time consuming bit. And then... After that, it should only be one, um, hopefully anyway, one game on squad battles, getting five assists with Borussia Dortmund players, and then there you go, you finish it. So don't go out and spend 20, well, 15K on all the items because you just don't need them. So anyhow, I'm going to start and I'm going to do my battles game, get five goals, and I'll be back to get uh, the kit unlocked, which will enable me to invite a friend, get a hat-trick, etc, etc. I'll be back when I'm on squad battles. 
Right, well, I'm on the squad battles, and uh, yeah, I mean, this is about to be my fifth goal with Haaland, so this should be pretty easy, if he decides to actually get in some space. Nope, okay. Let's have a look. He's offside, I think, yeah. Oh my god. Well, I've already scored four. Uh, it's quite easy. What I'm doing is literally just playing on professional on whatever the easiest squad is. So this is like a bronze with 68 chemistry, something like that. And then just running down the wing and then, well, wow. Because I'm on record, I can't fucking get the fifth goal. But you, you see what I mean. I'm trying to run down the wing with either Mane or whoever I've got. Say it again. unbelievable but once you've got this um yeah as i say the, the easiest uh one put it on professional and then yeah just literally do this and then harland i can probably cross there there you go and there's the fifth goal with harland so now i can just let the game end and that will be what was the next one you get the kit which will enable you to do the friendly Right, so we obviously did that on squad battles, really, really easy. What I would recommend for the next one is if you've got uh, any friends that do play FIFA, then invite them, get the hat trick with Haaland, and then just leave pretty much, well, get your, your mate to leave. If you don't have anyone that plays FIFA 21, I've got a Discord where you can find other people. I'll put in a link uh, in the description, but you can also just do it on squad battles. You know, it's a, it's an extra 10, 15 minutes if you can't be bothered with friendies or joining new Discord servers, that sort of thing. But we're going to claim this, and then what you need to remember to do is to assign the Borussia Dortmund kit. Now, I don't actually know a shortcut for this. Uh, I think you've got to go into your club. I don't think you can do it from this screen anymore, which is a little bit annoying. Um, no, I, I genuinely don't think you can. You've got to confirm the item. Then you've got to go to the transfer list of all places and then equip that. But once you do, as I say, either friendlies or squad battles, just score a hat trick with, uh, what am I doing? Uh, with Haaland and you'll be absolutely golden. So we're gonna, gonna equip that transfer list. Here we go. <laughs> wow, it, it's recording the fact that we got a kit. Nice. Uh, so if you press LS on Xbox, if you're not aware of how to get to your, your club or, well, it's L3 on PlayStation, basically the analog, just press it down. Um, yeah, club items, kit. Unfortunately, you can't actually search specifically for team kits, which is just silly, uh, but it'll be here somewhere. There we go, Borussia Dortmund. It's untradeable, so we're going to make that active for the United kit. And now we can invite my friend, get that hat trick, and I'll be back for the next little segment. Right, something I've just realised, do not go on the transfer list and equip your kit that way, because for some reason it glitches up and it gives you a weird white kit. What you've got to do is go onto Stadium, go on to Match Day, and then equip it there. So obviously from the main menu you push up, then you go on Match Day, and then it's home or away, it doesn't really matter as long as you've got it selected. There you can see we've got the Dortmund one. So now I'm going to invite my mate. We'll get uh, the TIFO or the badge or whatever it is. I think it's the badge. Then we'll play the Rivals games. Right, so we've got that. As you can see, three goals scored with Haaland. And it was like five minutes, I think. Uh, well, four minutes, 17. So I just did it on Mystery Ball just to get the pace and the... Uh, dribbling boosts which work quite well but there you go that's how you do that segment as quickly as possible then the next segment is going to be the most time consuming there's no shortcuts in there really but the good thing is you don't need to win you don't need to score assist you just need to play with one Borussia Dortmund player on your starting lineup and you also have to make sure that you've got the badge equipped um so yeah, we're going to claim that now. We've got daily objectives as well. So we'll claim those. We'll claim the week two for bronze as well. We'll be getting very close to getting a pack actually. So hopefully we can get that soon. But uh, let's have a look at this Haaland. So there we go. We've got the Dortmund hat trick. So we're going to get that. We're going to go into stadium, equip that um as our badge we've already got the t4 as you can see um but we're going to do it legitly so we can get everything um 
Yeah, I already had the Tifo untradeable, so yeah, I got one assist with Haaland on squad battles, but anyhow, right, match day, is it that for Tifos? No, crowds, I imagine. Crowds? Uh, yeah, it's not Tifo, is it? It's badge. I'm confusing myself. Right, match day, equip the Dortmund badge. There we go. Uh, where is it? And then play the five rivals games. I think what I'm going to do... Wait there, can I not? This item can't... Oh, oh, it has been set. There you go. There you go. We've got the Dortmund badge. I'm going to have a quick look and see what my team is. Because uh, ideally, I just want to get someone like Munai, the, the right back, or anyone in my club. Get them slightly off chem and uh, just sub them off, really. Uh, ideally, that would be the best course of action. So we're going to take off Douglas Costa and we'll see what other Dortmund players we've got in the club. Uh, Borussia Dortmund, let's have a look. Uh, we do not have any, so I am going to have to use Haaland, and it's not ideal, but I'm going to put him up front, um, and then I'm just going to sub on Mbappe, pretty much. I know he's off chem, it's not ideal, it puts Neymar off chem, uh, obviously Salah already is, but it's only playing games, and hopefully I can still get the wins anyway, so I'll be back once I've played the five. Right, so the most time-consuming bit of this has been completed. Five Rivals games just with one Dortmund player in your lineup. And you get a Tifo for this. I already have the Borussia Dortmund Tifo, as you can see. Oh, we got a Foot 20 Icons kit as well. Hmm, very interesting. Right, um, I think the other one I've got is untradeable anyway, so I'm just going to discard that uh, Borussia Dortmund Tifo since I've already got one. And yeah, now all we need to do is assist five times with Borussia Dortmund player in squad battles on minimum professional difficulty. So I'm just going to do exactly what I did last time, except this time I'm going to play Haaland on the wing. And then I might also work towards the week two silver at the same time. So I might bring on like an Italian player and see if I can do these as well at the same time. But anyhow, let's do it. Right, well that took a lot longer than it should have because there's a mistake on the Haaland assists, the Dortmund assists. Basically it says assist five times. What it means is assist in five games, which is really, really irritating. Literally there, assists five times with a Borussia Dortmund player in squad battles on minimum professional. Well, I assisted about eight in my first game and yeah, it only registered one. So I tried three different Dortmund players. It still only registered one. So you have to play five squad battles games, which is a little bit annoying. Uh, wait there, do I have to go on this to claim it? I am confused. Where is my pack? Hmm. Well, we have this, um, level 20. And then yeah, I don't I don't know how you go about actually claiming your pack and everything. Um, so for some reason, wow, Joe Felix has the average team XP is seven hundred and seventy. Wow, that's uh, that's crazy. So if I back out and go back, wait, did it give me it? Yeah, it did. There you go. It it usually comes up with a group uh, thing, but anyhow, right, we've got it. So. Let's open it and then we've also got the 25k pack for reaching level 20 on the season objective. So it's not a walker, it's not even a board. So in terms of the Haaland thing, wasn't really worth it for me by the looks of it. We get Andre Almeida. Not great there. But hopefully the 25k pack can be something. So it's untradeable for those who are curious, as you can see. But I, roughly because of those five squad battles games, I don't know if that's a glitch or if that's what they intended, but that means you're, you're playing a minimum of 12 games. Um, so that's four hours uh, game time. Oh, it's a Conan Ball player, fuck's sake. Well, this is good. There could be something like a Rashford in there or Sane or whatnot. There is not, there's a Benitez, so... Wow, bar that one day where I had insane pack luck. Uh, my pack looks been kind of dire but anyhow hopefully i've enjoyed hopefully i've been able to explain exactly how to get these done 
and then I'll do a follow up video when the event ends and when the new one starts so we can kind of understand if it is a 7.5k pack that we would be getting as winners or you know if the Felix wins what we'll be getting as a loser prize and that sort of thing so yeah peace